Hello lovelies, this is your girl Angel Bex. Actually, I'm uh, I'm from work. Yeah. Today is 29th, 29th March. Yeah, 29th March 2017. I'm um, 17 weeks, 17 weeks, Saturday, Sunday, 17 weeks and around five days pregnant. But I'm going to update you about my second, my the beginning of my second uh, trimester, and that is 14 and 15 weeks. Yeah. I couldn't shoot the video then. So actually during my 14 weeks and 15 uh, weeks pregnant, what was really happening? I thought I would stop morning sickness. But I was surprised the morning sickness did not stop. I kept on vomiting. Well, what to do? That's life. Yeah, so that is one of the things I was looking forward to, like to stop all this morning sickness. But it did not stop right away. I kept on uh, vomiting. I had a uh, 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 salivation, yeah, salivation. I had a lot of saliva in my mouth. That is another symptom. I was stressed, yeah, I had stress. Uh, some of the good things, I was also gassy. Yeah, like my stomach was all making all this blah, 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 you know. Uh, the good thing that was happening in my 14, 15 weeks pregnancy, I my bum started showing. I was really so excited to see it showing at least there was something, I mean, something uh, to be happy about. My bump starting starting to show, which was really, really, really very exciting for me. Yeah, but the, another another symptom that was happening during my 14 uh, weeks and 15, I started getting these dreams. My dear, these dreams have not stopped until now. I'm having these dreams. I dream, I dream every day. In my first trimester, I used not to dream. But you know, it happened, oh my God, every day. I'm, every night, I keep on dreaming. I used to have all these bad dreams, and I even could remember them. I could narrate them to my husband. But you know, uh, nowadays when I dream, I don't remember actually by the time it's morning time. But... I really dream. The dreaming is another symptom that really happened for me. What to, that happened to me when I entered my my second trimester. About my baby during this uh, time, uh, at 15 weeks, my baby was four inches long from crown to rump. Wow! So probably he was weighing around 2.4 ounces. So the length of a large pear. Uh, baby bones were. Baby, my baby bones uh, grew harder. Uh, his arms and fingers uh, also developed. Uh, the baby started practicing uh, breathing. So they were telling me, actually, all, oh, I'm getting all this, this, all this information I'm reading to you guys from uh, various websites and applications that I'm following. I'll be sharing with you probably in my upcoming videos. Uh, I'm following these uh, pregnancy websites, applications. You know what, what it is. You know, when you're pregnant, you really need to know what is happening to your body. So they keep on updating me every week, every week, what has grown. What I, By the time I go for my ultrasound, at least I'm aware that where I am, what is the size of my baby, and everything. Yes, so like I was saying, he's 2.4 ounces. So I decided to actually note them down so that I can be able to read it for you because I'm using my phone to shoot. Uh, my baby bones are harder, arms, fingers are all developed. Uh, the baby's practicing breathing. Can you imagine? So uh, they were telling me I should start talking to my baby that he's, he probably will be able to hear me. Wow, how cute is that? Yes, yeah, so I should start to talk to him and he's also making uh he or she well because i don't know the gender yet uh, is making movements yeah my baby is making movements his ears have developed like i've said so i should uh, start you know talking to my baby so those are some of the things that have really been that happened during my 14 and 15 trimester so just check out my ultrasound and yeah see more about it maybe you can be able to guess the gender Actually, I asked the doctor, can you be able to guess the gender? Then she was like, I can, but at this time, we cannot be 100% sure. Probably the next visit. So she tried to give, you know, some guesses, but I cannot sit on that. I need to wait until the next, uh, the next what? The next visit. Can you see the baby moving? Hmm.
difficult to know the gender still, I think. Really? Mm-hmm. Yes, but maybe a boy. It looks like a bo- so. boy. Maybe, but I'm not really sure. Uh. It's uh, still small. Mm. So not in everyday way it's easily seen at this week. Mm. Well, hopefully by next month we will know. Okay, it's fine. Okay. The heart rate is normal? 